Marquette fired men's basketball coach Steve Wojciechowski. In seven seasons, he never won an NCAA tournament game. Sports director Dan Needles is standing by in the studio. But first, let's go live to Stephen Watson on the Marquette campus with the latest. Stephen? Yeah, it's oddly symbolic that this decision was made today, the opening day of the NCAA tournament, because March Madness has been more like March Sadness in the Wojo era. Seven years under Steve Wojciechowski as head coach, just two tournament appearances, zero wins in that span. Athletic director Bill Scholl only had nice things to say about Steve Wojciechowski as a person, as a leader in the community, but it comes down to winning. Marquette has two losing seasons since 1999, Wojo's first year and his last year. You know, at the end of the day, I, I believe a storied program like this uh, and the support we provide to it, I, I think competing pretty consistently at the top of the Big East, pretty regular stream of, of NCAA bids and, you know, the occasional opportunity to run deep in March. I think those are all things that we as, as a program should aspire to. And as I look forward, I'm going to look for somebody who, who, who feels the same way and somebody that we believe can make that happen for us. And Scholl says that he is looking for likely a proven head coach to hope to take that vacancy. And the search begins immediately. Live from outside the Al McGuire Center, Stephen Watson, WISN 12 News. Thank you, Stephen. Dan Needles joins me now. And Dan, you were saying in the newsroom, it's surprising that they do this now because of the cost involved. A high cost, yeah. The school has not said how much it will cost to buy out the remaining years on Wojo's contract, but it's estimated to be in the high seven figures. Now, the school did say the money would come entirely from the athletic department. But has there been talk about Wojo's replacement? There has. So far, only rumors, but among the names they could target, former Marquette assistant coach Stan Johnson, Loyola Chicago's Porter Moser, former Michigan coach John Beeline, Alabama's Nate Oates, who's a Watertown native, Winthrop's Pat Kelsey, and Grand Canyon's Bryce Drew. The problem is those are hot candidates for a number of schools looking for a coach. All right, we will see what happens. Thanks very much, Dan. And we are hearing from the coach now. Coach Wojciechowski just issued a statement. It reads in part, days like today are unfortunately part of this profession, but I leave Marquette proud of what we achieved and with a lifetime of unforgettable memories.